Hi guys, we're Jungle Beats. This is my associate. Yeah! You can clearly see what team I'm on. The Pusha T team. And I'm... Sirloinus Sophie Saurus. You know whose side I'm on? I don't fucking know because I ain't heard this shit yet. Do you know how hard it was to avoid this shit? Oh my god. The internet. Pusher, 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 Drake, Drake, pusher, pusher. And I'm legit, I, I haven't looked on the internet for like a good two days, like properly. I haven't, I've been avoiding shit like the plague. And people come to my work, like, yo, what are you? I'm like, shut the fuck up, stop talking. I can't hear any of this shit. I need a fresh opinion. Shut your fucking mouth. So I've avoided it and. Yo, we're about to get to him right now. We're going to yeah. do the duppy freestyle. Then we're going to go to a new video. <laughs> so make sure you go <coughs> straight from the, the duppy. To the <laughs> straight from the duppy, straight from the duppy, straight from the duppy to the push your teeth uh, disc, and then we go see how we play this. You know, I'm sorry. I know, I know what you're saying. Man, I'm real excited for this right now. Okay, let's go. It's been a while since we had a disc. Drake hasn't you. been tested since Meek Mill, and let's be real, Meek didn't really test him. No, exactly. Not at all. So let's. You ready? I'm ready, man. All right, I'm ready as fuck. Duppy freestyle. All right. <laughs> So if you rebuke me for working with someone else in a couple of years What are you really thinking of nigga that's making your beats? I've done things for him I thought that he never would need Father had to stretch his hands out and get it from me I pop style for 30 hours and let him repeat Now you popping up with the jokes, I'm dead, I'm asleep Y'all are the spitting image of whatever jealousy breeds Don't push me when I'm in album mode You're not even top five as far as your label talent goes You send shots but I gotta challenge those I can never have a virtual in my circle and hold him back cause he makes me nervous I wanna see my brothers flourish to their higher purpose Yeah, your brother said it was your cousin and him and you So you don't rap what you did, you just rap what you knew Don't be ashamed, there's plenty oh. niggas that do what you do There's no malice in your heart, you an approachable dude Oh, oh. So the I see that Nike Mercedes. I had a microphone of yours, but then the signature faded I think oh. that pretty much resembles what's been happening lately oh. Please believe your demise will be televised Wait it there I really shouldn't have given you none of my time Cause you older than a nigga you running behind Look, <laughs> holla at me when you multi-million Tell Ye we got an invoice coming to you <laughs> Considering that we just sold another 20 for you Let's be honest Let's drop this down Okay That was dope the beat's nice. The beat's nice, but Drake's smooth. But Drake was had a lot of good lines on there. And great delivery too. Minus the ABC line, that was shit. <laughs> and there's a lot of stuff like you gotta understand the nuances of their career. Like he goes back as well. Okay, the first thing he goes, the first line Drake goes in on. So if you rebuck me for working with someone else in a couple of V's, what you really think of the nigga that's making your beats who's talking about Kanye, right? Coming back at him with like, yeah, he did the father had to stretch his hands to me, like that was a something a little more shot there. Yeah, father had to stretch his hands out to get it from me. Mm -hmm. right, that's a really clever line. I like that. I like it. But if you talk about like pushed calling Drake out right for um, using someone else to make his make his music, yeah, write his music. I think it was Quentin Miller, right? Exactly. Which was a while ago now. And he's saying Q, Q is yeah, who he's Q is Quentin Miller, right? But then Drake's like, use Kanye to make beats. So is that any? How is that any different? Yeah, and I think. There should be a conversation there. I think Drake's on point. Like, I feel like if someone's helping you write, that's a that's a part of the process. A lot of people that are in music understand, or should understand, that when you're in the studio with someone, the more people that are adding their heads and helping you get through. Because sometimes when you're thinking, you need other people around you to be like to see things in a different light or a different manner. Exactly. I, I think it's better when more people in the room writing. Collaboration is collaboration. Mm -hmm. He's just making a show. You collaborate with Kanye too. Exactly. So that's a really good point by Drake there. Let's keep it going. He said, "You're not even top five as far as your label talent goes." Now we all know that's a silly that, line. That's, right? that's. I mean, it's, it's it's a fun line, but even Drake knows that's not true. Exactly. So I, I mean, he's he's probably top three. It's a bit of Kanye's a, not on good music anymore. You could we could call Kanye in good music. He's not on there anymore, though, is he? Yeah, of course he is. He oh. just doesn't manage it. Pusher. The top three would what be it would kick color. So it'd be Kanye, Pusher, and Big Sean. I really can't think of anyone else that's on there. Oh, we got moment. Tiana Taylor. We got, um, is Travis on there? Can't remember. Uh, anyway, let's keep, it, let's keep it rolling. That's a good line. Oh, which one? The one where he goes, your brother, your brother said that you did think, like basically you came through like other people's eyes. It's like, you didn't sit, you didn't do what you knew. I want to see my brothers flourish to the higher purpose. 
No, it was his brother. So pretty much, your brother said it was your cousin yeah. and him than you. Yeah. So basically, because his brother's no mouse, of course, well, op, like knows mouse for clip stay. So he's saying that everything that he's been talking his whole life has been from another person's views and not his own view. Which is, you know, fair because Malice has said in videos, he has said in videos that it wasn't really there. Like, like part of it was, but a huge part of it wasn't. It was more the people that were with, so. Ah, and then he goes on to say, there's no Malice in your heart, you're an approachable dude. Which is great because there's no Malice, is his brother's rap name. Right. So really good line there. So he's calling him out saying, hey man, call, is he kind of calling him out like you didn't really live this life as much as you portray? Yeah, exactly. And I think that's exactly that line. The line, the pretty much the line saying, hey, if you're calling me out about getting people to help me write for me, why are you writing about things that didn't even happen to you specifically? So I think that's another good line. <laughs> now, do you know that push, uh, Drake had a signed microphone that he bought off eBay? When he was 17. In, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And now the, uh, now the signature faded. You know, and that's kind of a metaphor for like their relationship and everything. Mm -hmm. That's a really good line too. Yeah, he's just saying like, when I got it, you were you were like one of my favorite people that I looked up to. Yeah. But like, like over time, like things fade. So it's kind of like saying you're fading away. You're not as good as you used to be. Hmm. Mm. <laughs> that doesn't work. It doesn't work though, because just because you're kind of old, don't mean you ain't got like mm -hmm. uh, clout in the game. Jay Z you know, is an example of that. Mm -hmm. Kanye's becoming an example of that. Mm -hmm. Nas, we go on. An invoice? Did you see that on social media? I Dra saw something about it. Drake sent Pusher an invoice? An invoice of $100,000 for to good music. What for? Um, it's kind of a joke, I'll show you. Professional services rendered. $100,000, thank you for your business. Please remit checks to Ovo Sound. I don't get it. What's what's the what's the what's it for? Oh, Duppy, a malevolent spirit or ghost? Right, that's right. That's really cool. So malevolent means kind of like evil. So it's it's interesting. So he's like cursing him, kind of thing, maybe. Um, yeah. So the invoice is like uh, the promotional assistance and career reviving is what it says right there in the photo. Wow. Right. So he's saying like, hey, you're welcome, man, for reviving, helping revive your career at my expense. But that's $100,000. I don't think he actually sent it, bro. Are you sure? Drake's rich as fuck. I have no idea if he actually sent it. But it's, reckon, just, a screen, it's just a screenshot of a, of a fake invoice, it looks like. I reckon he would have sent it, man. Drake's like rich as fuck. $100,000 mean nothing to him. <laughs> you think he would just do that? Yeah. Just I for think, the fuck of it? Yeah, I think he would. I hope it's true. Dude, do you know how many fucking rich people out there just gamble and just bet like hundreds of thousands of dollars for the fuck of it? But then Pusher responded on Twitter. Yeah. I think it's a... I think it's a pretty good disc. Uh, it helps when you have a good beat behind it because so many discs I find have really average beats. But um, I feel Drake just throws a few shots, gets his points across. But I feel like the whole song really isn't a disc. Like there's parts of the song which is like Drake's just filling in certain lines. But, but it just seems like he's explaining his story, explaining yeah. the situation. I think it is pretty direct. Every pretty yeah, much every line's on I there. I think yeah, it's pretty it's pretty decent. So now I'm excited to know what Pusha says back and why the world. Is going crazy over this disc. Like, what's Pusher gonna say? So uh, we will get to that in the next one, y'all. Um, mm -hmm. Let's get straight to it, man. Jungle Beats. <laughs> Jungle Beats. Fuck with us. We go to Drake. Let's hit that Pusher now. Yeah. I stay silent because we at war and I'm very patient. Six God is watching. I just hope you're prepared to face him. I'm charged up. I'm charged up. 